Well, hello there, everyone. You have right here is this right here will be a Brave America. I, if you want to kind of call it like a symbol right here for like half right here is a drawing right here of me right here on the American flag. And you know, this right here could mean a, a number of things. But let's just say if one of those will be about speaking new to the country, you know. One of those in case of anybody that may warrant to word it uh, that back up those couple years ago whenever you would see a, like a cartoon TV show, uh, something you know, such as maybe the original uh, cartoon TV show of uh, Captain America or you know, some uh, show like that. And I want to know just a little bit too to where, yeah, broadcasting live, you know, broadcasting live on local you know, air or something like that. So, yeah, that um, anything that is related to any sorts of cartoon series or something. But I know a lot of things that I hear about on the news are going to be uh, related to about, you know, speaking up you know, for the rights and as well as uh, anything else that uh, that's going to maybe be associated with, uh, you know, yeah, the source of uh, of uh, if it's a sound quality, like, yeah, what, exactly what do cartoons necessarily tell us? But whenever I'm looking at this right here, I'm also thinking right here, like a type of Brave America to where that, um, that this right here would represent me in front of the American flag. And I know that a lot of our you know, veterans and patriots or anybody that may think that, uh, okay, you in front of the American flag, what exactly does that mean? And I know uh, that there's like not one... Uh, your student photo that I have in my whole collection from you know even since the second and third grade that would show me in front of the American flag so it seems like the only way that a picture like that would be taken maybe if uh, maybe if you're going to be serving in the you know in the military or be a, a veteran or somebody like that but let's just say that uh, that yeah just to be a US citizen but uh, still though that um, and a lot of things that I hear about on the news also is related to you know building the wall and as well as uh, other things you know say you know passing a bill to the Congress you know other things that they're talking about on the news, but I really just also want to mention here about College Junior. So by you know the year 2020 right here that I use this year right here in case if somebody were asked is that if you're going to maybe put that maybe like on a calendar I'm like by, by what uh, day of the month are you going to use this right here it's like a, you know, for a calendar title and uh, you know yeah I've already checked it out and um, according to uh, my understanding that my birthday uh, would come you know, right around uh, on that Saturday you know Saturday uh, July 18th of 2020 so let's just say that uh, possibility that uh, that by that time that maybe I'll be you know going into my junior year in college and I uh, want to know just a little bit too to where that you know anything that they're going to be talking about on the news and let's just say if one of these things would also be about you know yeah you know anything else that's going on here in America you know for what matters to us and you have right here is for all Americans and children at freedom you know for who uh, we are so I guess um maybe another quote I could have maybe added is to uh, for all Americans and Americans you know, also means children and then you know younger you know citizens and uh, so yeah that uh, so I guess you know somebody that may ask me that why is it that Americans and children are separate I'm like why is it that they have to be uh, provided on or separate and I guess uh, really do you have to be over 18 just to be able to be considered a, an American and uh, so that's why in case of somebody were asked me exactly that why is it that it's worded like that. But I can give the reason as to where that, that for most of the time, though, that whenever I'm uh, putting up my work together right here, that uh, a lot of times children are maybe not old enough to turn up just to really understand and realize about what exactly what the words are related to. And uh, but let's just say that um, that with children, though, that a lot of times it seems like, you know, you know, too young to understand, I guess, is kind of like what my statement is too young to understand the, the details and but then the Americans you know the adults would maybe think too is to where that yeah that you know you uh, are growing up and mature enough to really just to understand the, the details really but really though I guess the question kind of goes by you have right here is the American flag design right here I use this for brave America right here but still though that you know talking about the building the wall or if it's anything else that they're talking about the for you know for the nation for you know for this country and if somebody were asked me that um well what are your opinions about maybe about the farmers and then as well as building the wall 
building a wall basically means, in the case of anybody that may want to work, that basically you're know, building a wall. You're know, building a wall between here and maybe a, if it's a you know, country Mexico or maybe if it's a, between a, you know, ben, Von Durez or you know some country like that. If we're talking about building a wall between here and Mexico or maybe if it's along the Pacific or the Indian Ocean, and that basically that um, that yeah that uh, if we're talking about bridges that you know, cross the seas and bridges that uh, go over you know certain areas of uh, the Pacific or somewhere like that, and uh, your one or two is to word it uh, that if we build the wall, then how are we going to be able to extend, expand our infrastructure, you know, our, our bridges and all that? So in case of somebody may ask me that uh, you know talking about this. And want to know that how come you did not you know, put a bridge right there in the background, you know, a bridge or maybe a a big you know tall. I'm like, yeah, one of those the most amazing things that you've seen in America that uh, you know likely one or two that um, that whenever I was drawing this, that there's going to be a lot of people, you know, any, anybody else that's going to maybe suggest that you know you could have uh, maybe add like maybe like a little darker scene right, you know, like a little backdrop scene right here. Of a of a famous city or maybe a, of a bridge or a landmark or something like that, but uh, still they have right here is a Brave America right here, but I mainly want to use this right here. It's like for like a portfolio right here represents you for junior though, and uh, let's just say that uh, that yeah that uh, by my junior year and knowing about the most important you know, possibilities that could come up, and uh, one of those possibilities is that uh, that yeah I was a student during the time, and let's just say that. Um, if you got uh, you know other you know, the elections uh, or something like that you know something you hear about on the elections saying that they need that to, to have so many votes just to be able to pass a bill and uh, this is how uh, and uh, and I know in case of somebody says this is how that we were able to define you know, certain information as to where if you're a registered voter if you are registered to vote then this is basically about how we found the information and. Uh, so yeah, this right here is not my date of birth. So in case if we're warning too, that if you're looking at the year, why is it that the year is going to kind of give everybody, which call this a moment to where that, um, that yeah, that this is supposed to be like a type of clue right here to where that okay, uh, is that supposed to mean anything? And uh, such as, I mean, anything such as like any source of identification. College junior right here. You know, college junior, that uh, you know, by that time that you know, I'll be entering you for you know, for the college junior year, and I I kept thinking too that by 2019 I was going to be entering my college junior year. But let's just say though that uh, that by 2020, that depend on how everything goes, is that you know, between a you know, junior and senior year. But uh, talk about for brave America. Brave America basically means to me is to where that if you're brave enough to stand in front of a group of people and just start talking about stuff. You know, being bright and positive about the future, though, and uh, a lot of times it seems like that a lot of us will probably be too shy to do something like that. But why is it that, that uh, with this design right here, in case of anybody that may warrant to work, that you know, really though, the way I have this, you placed right here, it's almost like that. Uh, that yeah, if it's supposed to appear like on a TV show or something like that, and uh, you know, any source of illustration work. And uh, 102 is that really if it's supposed to mark for the freedom for the country or is it just supposed to be marked because you were a student during a time? And uh, I could probably be honest with anybody. It was supposed to mark that I was a student during a time. Not really that, uh, you know, well, during that time that, that there was a, a war that was going on. Like, yeah, during, during that time that, uh, you know, I was uh you know, knowing that you know, something that, that was going on here in this country or something like that, or something to help Congress with or something like that. So in case that somebody may want to worry that anything else that uh, that you may have a question about, and but still though that uh, one of those questions would be as to where to all Americans and children. So I think that usually that the present State of the Union ad address is usually titled for all Americans, and um, so I know that. Uh, Brave America for what matters though. But you see right here, this right here was about you know, two years ago. So, so since then I've updated it. But uh, still, whenever I was drawing this, I mainly want to show right here is that this right here will be example right here of me right here. 
and that, you know, America does not represent just, you know, the 4th of July or just based on the wars or if it's anything uh, related to building a wall or something like that. That was around my birthday, everybody. My birthday came after the 4th of July, and uh, I really, you know, I really don't know what I would say that if somebody were to say that, um, that you know, whenever the wall is going to be built or if everybody or if all Americans could have access to their own, you know, treasury, you know, account to where if it's a Department of Treasury, in case of somebody that may ask me that if there's anything inside that maybe that, you know, if there's anything such as if we can all write our own rule on a Declaration of Independence in 102, one of those rules would be as to where the source of education that maybe all uh, children would need to be aware of. And uh, no matter if it's uh, email alerts or anything like that, and you're likely warned too uh, that, okay, um, you know, anything uh, that is related to, uh, you know, yeah, that this was your idea from a, a few months ago, but then now uh, people are now following up about that. But still, though, that this right here, yeah, this right here may be like an example right here for like a creative idea for like maybe for a student ID. But let's just say that maybe if Congress uses right here just to pass a bill, and in case of anybody that may ask me that, you know, do you think that, that you really authorize, would you authorize Congress to do that? Let's just say that if they can maybe use your information, like use your creative idea, you know, just to be able to, you know, for Congress. But still, though, that, um, you know, as I say that, you know, yeah, that uh, they talk about a lot of stuff in Congress so many times to where half the time it seems like that it's going to be wallpapered all over the media. And uh, you're likely wondering, too, that the reason why I put this together was to speak up for my rights about for brave America. It's supposed to be about, you know, getting away from all, you know, for being, you know, not being so shy in front of a group of people and talking about what you think that's right for what goes on in this country. But uh, still, though, that, uh, then let's just say that maybe like a, like a crumpled up map, and I, I know crumpled up map I mean by is toward it. This, uh, you know, you know this uh, painting right here was originally uh, printed on on a piece of paper, and let's just say that um, had you decide to crumble it up and just do all sorts of different types of shapes and all that stuff just to maybe show it, and then. Uh, Let's just say that, uh, you know, yeah, that maybe if there's a change in a direction or something like that for where it goes to, you know, really. I really don't know, but other than that, uh, Brave America, though, I mainly want to talk about right here for 2020 right here. Because in case of anybody that may ask me that, you know, okay, 2020, uh, that, you know, exactly, what exactly does that mean right there for 2020? It means by, you know, in case of anybody say that's, around the time that I'll be entering my junior year. And uh, I kept thinking too, by next year, I'll be entering my junior year, but then by 2020, and knowing about if I'm gonna be graduating, but some uh, of us Americans may also think as to where that there's supposed to be maybe like a book or a calendar published, knowing about, you know, the good brave America, you know, young man or something like that. But I tell everybody that uh, you know, I'm mainly doing this for my source of education, uh, but you know the bright source of education would also maybe be about in case of anybody that may warrant toward it. Yeah, building the wall, building the wall between here and maybe countries of Mexico or somewhere like that. Really, who's brave enough to speak up about that, and who's brave enough to speak about anything that they don't like for what's going on? But still, but uh, talk about for college junior and. Uh, so I know that uh, looking at this right here, and uh, in case of somebody may want to, that, uh, you know, yeah, that uh, with anything that goes on, you know, in, in the country, that uh, want to know just a little bit of that too, to where, okay, you know, anything that goes on, you know, in this country, though, that, that you're psycho, you know, yeah, that um, you're going to have that to where that, um, that you speak up, you know, if you feel comfortable speaking up about something. But really, though, that, um, this right here is supposed to be yeah, an example of uh, me as a college student. And uh, not really that, uh, but still could have also be marked as for a United States citizen. But uh, Mike, we'll just see what happens. Huh? But anyway, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.